five holes. Yes. So there's one, there's two, there's three, there's three, eight, four, and five. So shall we go That's and six. have a look around? The tickets are in great demand. Yeah, it isn't it? <laughs> six holes. So let's go have a guided tour, a quick tour around of what we're going to see at the motorhome show and even have a look at some caravans for you. Yes, and as we know, it's sold out as well. Sold out. So this might be the only yeah, chance you get to see this. How much could you get for one of these? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, Somebody rang up on Friday offering £100 for it. Take it. Yeah. I know they took your Thank ticket you. and give it in. Well, you nearly never got in, did you? <laughs> I know. Right, let's go and have a look. So, hall one. We've got tables. We've got the Caravan and Motorhome Club. Yeah, the Caravan and Motor Club. So this is Sorry, the members. The, the, the Motorhome Club. Motorhome Club, that's the one. So... We have the Oyster Stand um, for the satellites. We've got the Truma. Do we need any parts for any of the vans? Could have brought a screwdriver with us, couldn't we? <laughs> Oh, yeah, let's have a pan. Right, we've got... Here's your favourite van here, Cathargo. No, this is a Malibu. OK. What's the difference? A few quid. Right. Educate me, Shane, educate me. So, I mean, let's, uh, let's, let's go on. So we've got... Let's start with the left. So we've got the Malibu to the left, which is the slightly lower-priced version of the Cathargo, is the best way to put it. Right. Or Cathargo. Yep. Depending on how you want to put it. Well, they do some really, really high spec vans. I think they're in the 70s in terms of price. Okay. But they are very, very charming indeed. And then you've got the A class. Well, the finish on them is incredible. So you want to go down this way? Yeah. So we've got all eight classes along here, haven't we? Oh, yes. Okay. So we've got the Sea Tourers, we've got the Sheik C lines, we've got the Sheik E line, which is slightly a higher version, we've got the tag axle, we've got a lot. Last time I was looking at you and I was driving in that. You remember? Yeah, we were, weren't we? Oh, and then we've got my favourite at the back, we've you... got the liner for two. Yes. That's a nice stand. Yeah. Um, Rapido. Very nice stand. Look at the front of the, the camper van over there. Do Rapido's you want, not changed much, has it? Do you want one of these for free, Kev? Do you want one of these for free? One of these for free? Yeah. Yeah, come on, I'll have those for now. You're a dreamer, aren't you? <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Yes, so that's again, we're getting, we, we, we're Dreamer getting, by Rapido. We're getting the pop tops yeah, again as well. So yes. This is the These are under Dreamer again, so they're the funds. Right. On the Peugeot. And then we've got the Itinios. A and I'd like to have a look at these Itinios because I haven't seen one for a while because we've changed their front end on these a little bit again. <laughs> right. The Artinios are a bit quirky, they've got some nice layouts, like they've got, I don't know if they've got it here. Not a bad they, price? No, no, they're not a bad price. I don't know if it's that one there, it's actually an end bunk bed, A class, which are traditionally a seven berth. Right. Yeah. If that's the model that they've got, if they still do that model. Uh, might not. Well, yes, they have had seven berths on these. But they've just, like I said, they've just got some quirky layouts with the bunk beds on the back, which you yeah. don't see in another A class. No, true. So you've got a family that wants bunk beds, that's the one. And again, this, this itinio, I can't say it. 75 cents, 6k. Yeah. For an A which class. For an A class, he's on the lower end now. I mean, you roll the team Bacassos are getting towards that, but not quite that. Is it part of the repeal? Yes. I think so, yeah. I tell you, I have a look, I'll have a good look at one and buy one tomorrow. Yeah. First one in about two years. So we're moving on now to uh, Naus and Winesburg as yes. well. 
Okay, so we're going to have some caravans and probably motorhomes on the Vinesburg stand. Now some Vinesburg stand. It'll be interesting on the Vinesburg stand, or I think it's Vinesburg, they've gone to Mercedes chassis only right. from Fiat. I think because they can get them. Starting from quarter two, eh? Yeah. Do you Yeah, so they have got some of the, the, uh, the nets. So yeah, you've got the camper, you've got the coach built. Go straight through. We've got a man. Yeah. Ah. The Weinsberg. Right, so this is what I'm talking about here. Yeah. Left hand drive. Yes, because this is a brand, brand, brand new model. They only announced this about three weeks ago, Vinesburg, that they're on the Mercedes cab now. They've ditched the Fiat's, I believe, just because they can get them more readily available. Starting from quarter two, so that'll be one of the first ones that are out there. Yes, yes. Been very popular, a bit more of a rugged look. It's A-class Vinesburg, yeah. Ooh. The Caracol. Referee. New yellow trainers. cars. Yellow cars. <laughs> <laughs> new trainers. Oh, they've got a scuff on them there. Oh, you've scuffed the trainers. <laughs> Look at the front end on that. I like those square headlights on that. It's nice. It's yeah. Nice. So we're going to move through Fabtex TVs. We've got Caravan Guard. Isabella awnings. Which are obviously nice awnings. Yeah, I think the most popular awning, the Isabella. Um, yeah, they're up there, aren't they? They're one of the top three, definitely. And if you go on to some places, like I'd Love to Stay, which is near you at Shrewsbury, yeah. they've got pictures with these ready-made, so you just drive up to them. Yes, they have, haven't so they? I think it's very yeah, smart. Yeah, yeah. And um, if we cut through... Got Dometic on the far left. Then we've got Broad Lane Leisure. Now, if you want somebody to see okay. somebody who does Snapchat, right? Okay. <laughs> no, TikTok, not Snapchat, TikTok. Yes. Um, Do a very good job on TikTok. Yeah, TikTok. yeah, yeah, yeah. So we've got the Swift. I mean, there's some people that won't know what that is, but... <laughs> nah, some of the older people won't. Yeah. You've got the Fairway. Yeah. And then, what else have we got? Oh, no, it's, it's the dealer stands, I think, mainly here. So yeah, mainly in Hall 1, isn't it, the dealer stuff? Yeah, so we've got Robinsons. Couplands. I can't say I've ever heard of them. What are they? Yeah. <laughs> They've been around since 1975. Seven, 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 seven. So basically, Hall 1, we're starting off with... Look at um, this, look at this. This it's is nice. the more rugged one I was talking about about two minutes ago. Yeah. Look at that. Nice big chunky tyres in the matte black. That's on the name, yeah. That is a man. No, that just is a beast. Oh, that'd be a nightmare, wouldn't it? Just don't get a stone chip. Don't go on a rugged path. Yeah. So then we're moving on to Platinum Wave. Yeah. Which are basically um, convert campers. And it's all pretty much Volkswagens. Right. Where's he gone then? Getting too busy now, isn't it? Where's he gone? Oh, you're there. Oh, you're there. He's <laughs> stood there, just like <laughs> turning around in circles. Um, uh, what about these? Wing them. Yes. What do you know about these? I don't know. I'm going to have to wing it. <laughs> right. Seven what, what do you see about this body? Ah, it's monocoque. It's all a in monocoque. One. Oh, yeah. All in one. 
who's... It's basically a one-piece shell. It's a one-piece shell, so you're not going to necessarily get any leaks or anything like that. Yeah, However... Yeah, you put them on at the price. Yeah. For this one, £94,500. And I'm, what's that, about six metres? Yeah. yeah. So a little compact, but... Well, the, the cost... Is, the cost is in the shell. Yeah. yeah, they've got little cute little caravans, haven't they? You know, I never did, realised they did caravans. But if you just look at the corners here, look. <laughs> there's just no joins all the way around. It's just one solid unit. Even the bumpers are all one yeah. piece. So you have to to do a bit more with the outside. Yeah, I mean, uh, just an interesting one, Jason. How would you go about repairing one of these if you took the corner out? Yeah, easy. It's all one piece, mate. So it's five blocks. Put your glass fit. There you go. That's put you in your place, hasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Quite interesting, that is, the Wingums. Don't believe so, no. no. Do you think they're easier than the plastic ones? I'd love to see the price of an A-class <laughs> monocot. <laughs> right, so let's move on to hall two now, eh? Right, let's just go and have a look at these here. So we've got here Platinum Wave campers. Right. Who are trying to take, or not trying to take over the world, they're, they're doing a very good job in doing so. They, they're in quite a few different dealerships now, and they do some very nice That's a nice, things. that's nice. Somebody who's very good at social media, Danny. Yep. Doing a very good job trying to do it bigger and better than everybody. But, I mean, just straight away, just looking in there, you've got, you know, that thing's like a microwave, microwave yeah. set in. But the microwave's not going to work off grid, is it? How many, how many people go off grid? What do you How many people go off grid? You've got a point, really. <laughs> no. <laughs> right, shall we move on to the next one? <laughs> Everybody says they're going to go off grid until they go off grid. They then realise they can't wash their hair. <laughs> yeah. So, Hall 1's pretty much made up of Cathargo, Rapido and some dealers. Yeah. So we move on to the next one? Yes. Okay.